Welcome to MyBinding.com. The Swingline Heavy Duty Stapler is one of the most affordable you'll ever find. That being said, it can be more troublesome. So now for some troubleshooting. It is fairly easy to jam. So if this happens, push down on the front black tab and swing it open. Any troublesome staples should fall out. Make sure that the loading mechanism is in place so it pushes all the staples forward and out the stapler. There have been questions on how to load the staple. Well, push forward, up, and then bring the mechanism back to then be able to place in your staple strip. You'll see how it basically just hooks in place. Then put your staples in and hook it back into place. To remove the staples, they should just slide out the back. If they do not, however, you can load your staples in smaller pieces. That way you can open up the front and they'll just pop out. It's not what it's meant for, but it is a workaround. Next make sure that you're using the correct size staple. You can see that I have a staple that is too large for this stack. It's troublesome and unsightly. Always refer to the guide on the front for what size to use. To play it the safest, we recommend getting the Swingline Heavy Duty Staples that have a product number starting with 353 and followed by two more numbers depending on the size. For best practice, you'll see that when you bring the stapler down, make sure it goes down all the way. There is a point where it needs more pressure to complete the stapling process. If you do it fast enough and hard enough, this goes unnoticed in one clean motion. 